Leo, what's going on with you? I hope you guys are doing lovely. This is gonna be a singles reading. All right, it's long overdue. Let's jump straight into it. All right, what's going on with the single lions and lionesses? What's going on with the single lions and lionesses? What's going on in your love life, ladies and gents? <clears throat> whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa. The tower. Major change. This could be for the good, this could be for the bad. The tower, this is a clear indication that you may be experiencing a major change in your current circumstance, Leo. All right, <clears throat> tell me more. Tell me more. What is Leo going through? What is Leo going through? Tell me more. Well, there we go, baby. It seems as if some sort of change is going to ensue and coming together in some sort of joyous endeavor. All right, you could be going on a date, you could be going, spending quality time with someone, you could be going on a party, you could go party with someone. Nevertheless, it seems that things are looking on the upside for you based on this, <clears throat> on this situation. Now, I don't know why I'm getting the sense that, all right, this is definitely not new love. This is, this is not new love. I feel that someone here is coming forward and basically expressing something that has this energy of reconciliation, truly, okay? It's like possibly you and someone left in, in a bad stance. Well, it's being reconstructed, all right? It's being reestablished. Tell me more, Leo. King of Cups. Look, whatever the hell has ensued between you and someone, Leo, love was always there. There was always a desire to connect on a very deep level. I feel that. The emotional balance between within someone here, which could be you or, or whomever it is that you're dealing with, was never lost. There's it's like there's someone here exuding this very mature, emotionally mature energy, and I feel that like it is this individual that's initiating this uh, this action toward addressing what needs to be addressed so that the relationship can prosper. All right, I feel that it, that there's something quite tumultuous that needs to be addressed, Leo. And I see a conversation coming that is not going to be easy, but necessary. All right, so tell me more about this communication. <clears throat> well, this, commu this difficult communication that's happening is basically what's going to be the catalyst to you and, and someone here experiencing a sense of, of a balanced flow regarding reciprocity, the exchange between one another, the energy exchange between one another. It seems as if, as if it's gonna be open. I feel that. Recently, there could have been a sense of invulnerability. So you and this person could have been, you know, not necessarily connecting on a deep level. It was possibly surface level or nothing at all. But I'm seeing that the opportunity for vulnerability is what's coming your way. The opportunity for exactly that, for vulnerability to be experienced is what's happening here. And that's, the, that's what's absolutely necessary, guys to to basically cultivate a relationship i mean you can't really cultivate a relationship when you have walls up all right in the midst of this where does leo find themselves what is leo's energy what is leo's energy what is leo's energy in the midst of this what is leo's energy in the midst of this the world card you're ready to bring closure to this shit, leo look at you right here all right, you're done with anything that just brings a lack of clarity when it comes to your love life. You're wanting truthful, honest communication. You're wanting to experience the avenue of love. That is where I'm seeing Leo's energy. Oh, fuck. Let's see. <clears throat> I got a haircut and I keep looking at myself and I'm like, God damn, I look good. She looks fresh. Looks fresh. I was getting way out of hand. If you see last week's video, ladies and gentlemen, I look like goddamn Wolverine. And um, it was about time that I fucking cut the fro off. Tell me more. What's going on with Leo here? What is their energy? I mean, I just see very positive energy. Like, that's it. I'm getting redundant messages, Leo. World to the ace, right? This is closure, beginning of a new chapter. You're ready to wrap up the past and you're ready to just open up a new chapter here that entails a massive sense of potential. And that's all it is. It's like you're completely open to see what develops here in this relationship, right? And you're doing so with, a, with an element of righteousness, with an element of of like, there's a huge maturity. There's a there's an, an element of maturity here that I'm picking up from you. And 
And what I mean by maturity, I don't mean like your age or anything like that. I mean your sense of navigating your emotions, your sense of navigating a relationship. That's the sort of maturity that I'm talking about. And you are just absolutely taking that leap flat out. That is where I'm seeing your energy, Leo. <clears throat> now, <clears throat> let's look into the person you're dealing with. What's going on with this individual? What's going on with this individual, Leo? What's going on with the person that you are dealing with? What's going on with the person that you are dealing with? Boom. All right, so it, it may be your per, your person. There's a there's an element of reminiscent. Uh, there's a reminiscent energy here, nostalgia. Okay, so if you guys have been in separation for some time, this person was heavily, or you were heavily on this individual's mind. All right. Otherwise, they got some very benevolent feelings towards you. Some very kindred energy. It's kind of like uh, like a child, like children interacting. You know, it's just so blissful. It's so honest. It's so authentic. That's the sort of uh, energy that I'm picking up from this person. And they're just compelled to bring about um, whomever it is that you're dealing with. I do get the sense that they're a bit sensitive here. All right. They're a bit light. Um, they could be emotional. They could be an, a very emotional individual. All right. With that said, they could be prone to going through very difficult emotions, which, which, um, which makes sense here. Now that I'm seeing this. All right. Nevertheless, here it, it looks contradicting, but it's not. It's like, look, the person that you're dealing with is an emotionally mature individual, but they, but with that sense of emotional maturity, they have a very profound um, emotional side that when they open up and when they they become vulnerable with this sense, it's something that is very childlike. All right, is what I'm picking up here. Very childlike, very kindred, very benevolent and, and kind, so on and so forth. All right. That's the sort of energy that I'm getting from them. They also have this propensity to work and see eye to eye with you flat out. They want to work on it. They want to basically build a relationship together. They want to build this connection together, Leo. They want to build this connection together. That's it. This is like this individual here is decided, Leo. This individual decided they're like, they made up their mind here. All right. They made up their mind and they're just moving forward without any sense of doubt. Just absolute conviction in regards to where it is that they want to go. Let's find out where do they want to go? Where do they want to go with this? What is it? What is their goal here? Stability, ladies and gents. All right. They're basically seeking to establish stability in this relationship. That is what I'm saying here. Tell me more. Wow, look at that. They find you very attractive. They find you heavily attractive. They think you're hottest. I gotta watch my French. They think you're very hot. All right, they think you're very hot, Leo. I mean, you must be hot. You look hot, all right? That queen of wands, that's you. And goddamn, that's the sexiest queen of them all. All right. <clears throat> Males. Do not, I mean, whatever, you know what I mean? Whatever. <laughs> so, let me see. I'm going to bring you some sense of guidance here regarding any advice that wants to come forth for Leo when navigating this relationship. Anything that will bring clarity to their trajectory. Wow, look, let me tell you what the potential is here, ladies and gentlemen. There's potential for, for true love. And what is true love? It's selfless love. All right. It's not self-interested love. It's not like, hmm, what can this individual, what am I going to take from this relationship? All right. What's, what's, what am I, what, what's there to take? It's not like that's more so like, all right, I'm connecting with this person. And I definitely want to put the interest of the relationship before my interest, before my personal interest. All right. That's the sort of energy that I'm picking up. That is what the potential is within this relationship, Leo. And that's possibly you possibly already know that. And that's why you're so keen to just jumping into this situation, putting away the old and opening up to new beginnings within a relationship. So you guys are having a very, very positive tower moment this week. All right. Beautiful, Leo. I'm going to take this to the extended, guys. I'm going to continue to expand on this individual. I'm going to look deep within them. I'm going to look at their motives, their long-term motives. I'm also going to look at their feelings. 
Uh, I'm also going to bring forward a message that they have not conveyed to you, that they would like to convey to you. Also, the trajectory. Given what we've already seen thus far, where is this going? All right. The link to that will be in the description. I'll see you guys there. I will see you guys around.